Traffic congestion is one of the most serious problems of urbanization. Seoul also had the same issue some decades back. However, now the city offers very quick and efficient public transportation, consistently voted as one of the best in the world for its ease of use, cleanliness, and frequency of service. Seoul Topis is in charge of operating and managing Seoul's overall traffic, and the data gathered at the control tower is shared with the public via smartphone apps. Using cutting-edge IT technology, this integrated traffic information helps clear heavy traffic, avoid sudden traffic issues, and offers real-time traffic information to the public. Also, Seoul now offers bike and car sharing services to expand the city's environment-friendly traffic services. Transportation is one of the biggest problems in developing countries. Therefore, Seoul Topis is essential for them. Actually, I have really visited several cities where they have such traffic management center. And here it's very much special and it is why because you've integrated all transportation aspects, emergency related um, information systems, public transport was here, traffic management. The capital city of Ethiopia, Addis Ababa, has been growing by an annual average of 10% in recent years. For the successful urbanization of the city, the mayor of Addis Ababa paid a visit to Korea, along with some other officials in the country. They're hoping to expedite the process with the help of Seoul. Seoul is uh, particularly in housing, uh, creating a decent and uh, very sustainable settlement for the community. And Seoul has a very great success in this area. We visited and also many experience sharing has been made with uh, practitioners and policy makers here in the Seoul municipality. And uh, so the experience of Seoul, the best practice of uh, Seoul city is, is very important for Addis Ababa. People can go anywhere using public transportation. Also, there are many smartphone apps offering public transport information that allow people to find the quickest routes for their journey. And environment-friendly transportation is gradually expanding. With eco-friendly transportation, the city hopes to reduce CO2 emissions, even if it is just a small degree. Seoul offers another kind of eco-friendly transportation for the sharing economy. SoCar, based in Seoul, provides car sharing services. Citizens can rent shared cars for the hours reserved, and then return it to a location more convenient for them.